about like the academic resources and what services have you used and all of that so we're just taking a little bit of a break right now and i just wanted to check in with you guys because i haven't talked to you guys all day and thank you you yeah. drink it did you drink it all you drink it all anyways i'm doing class in my room today because yeah i just couldn't <laughs> Yeah, I didn't feel like going downstairs and sitting on the couch. I just wanted to sit in my bed today. I threw on my little wig, even though I really needed to wash it, honestly. But, yeah. So, right now we're just going over... We just finished our farm class, going over GI secretion meds. And now we are in our 102 class, and we're going over... like urinary and bowel elimination and nutrition that's our next test and it was actually scheduled for this friday but <laughs> she moved it to next week because obviously like we're a little we're a little behind so we should actually push back our first test and we're supposed to have like five tests so we're just supposed to because um, you I don't know, I've just been so tired of you guys, like, I think it just, you get to that certain point in the semester and you're just freaking tired, like, no matter how much sleep you get, you're just exhausted, you know, but yeah, I'll catch up with you guys in a bit, actually, yeah, I'll show you guys what I got for my two tests, but I didn't even tell you guys, <laughs> even though I knew right away what I got, but. Yeah, I'll show you guys what I got on my test. We actually went over our farm test today, and then we did our um, 102 test yesterday. So I'll just kind of show you guys what I got, and maybe just talk about like how I studied. I don't know. Maybe I'll do that like after, like do a sit down video of how I study because it seems to be working. Even though, honestly, farm is really getting me. Like I did good. But I just had to think a little bit more on the answers, and I don't like that feeling of good. Alright, I'll check in with you guys later. Okay, we haven't started yet, so I'm just going to show you guys real quick what I got.
the beginning of the semester, we were informed that, um, I don't know what she is exactly, but someone wanted to like do a research project due to like everything that was going on with COVID and like, you know, nursing schools having to do like clinicals and labs online using simulation and stuff like that. So long story short, she's just investigating the different types of um, learning that we can do. So labs, clinical, and simulation pretty much. And like, um, how do I word it? Basically like how, how well do we like retain the information and like which one is like the most beneficial? Oh, I don't know if I'll use this. It might be shaking. basically like what the research project is and um so today was like day two or part two of that research which was like um virtual simulation so online simulation and that's what we pretty much did for all of lab and like maybe like the last 20-30 minutes we went back to like our normal classroom <coughs> Just went over IV drip calculations uh, because we are supposed to do IV fluid administration next, not next week, uh, Friday, Friday. We're doing IV fluid administration, so we kind of went over like how to calculate that if the pump isn't working pretty much. Um, I think I got a little clip of like my lab and kind of like what it looks like.
was just like, I don't know, I was just tired. And then, so my son, he is three. And he does still sleep in the crib, even though it's like one of those reversible cribs where we can change it into a toddler bed. We just have not gotten to it, honestly. Like, I really just have not gotten to it. And so he's at this moment where he, what is it called? He like just wants to climb out of his bed. Like, oh my gosh. He'll climb out of his bed like two, three o'clock in the morning. And then he'll just bang on my grandma's door. <laughs> trying to let like trying to get her to let him in her room it's just like he is banging on the door like he's the police like it would be funny if it wasn't three o'clock in the morning it would be hilarious <laughs> when i think about it now i'm like oh my god he's so funny but mm. anyways on my way to clinical and i will just catch up with you guys later He was fine at first, and then he was like, he went to the bathroom, came out, and was a whole new person. I swear, I was like, Ooh, okay. like me and the nurse were looking at each other, like, mm. <laughs> and you know, she's like, okay, like Rochelle is gonna give you an injection, and he was just like, just staring, like, and she's like, just describing like the different type of needle because the one that we used before, it was like. would push down and a thing would come over the needle and this one you push down and the needle kind of goes back like it retracts and he's like oh like do you want her do you do you need to do this like kind of like oh I don't know if she should do this kind of and she's like oh no I'm just describing like the needle and he's just like staring at us like <laughs> I did it <laughs> but I was just oh my gosh Anyways, that was interesting. Um, it was honestly like very, very chill. Like, even though she literally had five patients, it wasn't too crazy. It seemed like she had like a really good grasp of like time management, but also most of the patients weren't very critical. I know the one that was like staring at us kind of weird, he wasn't really critical. Like, was able to like walk around he was ambulating and all of that like he was very independent um one guy though i felt so bad like he you could just tell he was in so much pain he got out of surgery i'm not really sure when but when he would i'm trying to think of like the medical term 
when he, yeah, so when he would pass stool, it was very like bloody and liquidy and did not look good. Like twice within, I don't know, an hour or two, he had stools like that. And I guess like last night, he had like three of those type of like red, bloody, loose stools. Um, so they were going to do a laparoscopy. I want to, oh, what is this? Excuse <laughs> me, what's going on? But um, yeah, they were going to do a laparoscopy on him just to kind of see what's going on. <coughs> was definitely interesting. You could tell he was in a lot of pain though, so I just felt really bad for him. Um, what else? The patient with the JP bags draining that fluid um, actually had her rectum like I didn't even get to see it. I was hoping I would get to see it, honestly. I was hoping, but no. She had a oh god where like a portion of her GI tract was like taken out so she literally could not eliminate through her rectum she, yeah like she she's going to have to use this um, colonos colostomy bag forever I'm guessing um, yeah I guess her rectum was just stitched shut or I don't know exactly how that works, honestly. But that was like really interesting. I didn't know they did that. So I was like, oh my god. <laughs> Anyways, yeah. Today, I mean, we definitely had interesting patients, but it was definitely very chill. We had like, plenty of time. You know, I didn't feel like we were in a rush ever. So yeah, my nurse was really nice. Like honestly, I haven't had a negative experience yet. Knock on wood.
Okay, so real quick, I ordered some things from Shein. So they just got here today. So I think I'll just open them up for you guys. All right, I'm just gonna show you guys like super quick a few things that I got from Shein. So, I got these jeans. So cute. They're kind of stretchy. Oh, and look at It's like not focusing at all. Anyways, the thing is already like done. I got a size large, so we'll see. Oh, I forgot about that phone case. I think I got like three of these little like workout shirts. This is the back. This is the front. Mm -hmm. I just wear like workout shirts because <coughs> it should be working out consistently, but I don't know. Honestly. Oh yeah. It's got like this basic and this is long. This basic like red top with like a little split in it, if you can see. I might like do little videos of me wearing this stuff. this video up. Okay, so another tank top. Just like a basic charcoal. Well, I guess it's black, which is like white flecks in it. Like that. I got another pair of jeans. I really just wanted some jeans that like fit well because I feel like all my jeans are just like a little bit too tight honestly like these don't feel super stretchy though so okay so extra large it is big but yeah I like the pet that looks cute and then the bottom is like <clears throat> distress. I wanted like some distress jeans, but I also wanted like some regular no rips pretty much jeans as well because sometimes that could be annoying. This is just like the pink one, but it's blue. It's so cute. I love that color. I think it's perfect too because spring is right around the corner. Who is this? I got tights. These are like very thick. Hmm. Okay, I got tights because I got these outfits. Oh, look at that. I've never seen that before. <clears throat> yeah, I got these outfits for me and my kids to take pictures. I still have to find a shirt for my husband actually. Oh, okay, and this one is kind of like the black one. Yeah, I totally got spring colors in it. That's so funny. Okay, what is this? Oh, I got like a workout jacket because I don't really have one. I have two and I have no idea where they went. Like, I literally don't know. Yeah, it's like very thin. I like that. And I think there's. Okay. I have like a little hole for your thumb, which I like. <coughs> we bought some leggings. Oh, that's the back. Leggings, so cute. I feel like these look, these look big. That's good. I feel like I didn't have any leggings also that were super comfortable. Like they all are just a little bit too tight. 
And then I got two phone cases. Oh, actually, oh, this is so adorable. Oh my gosh, you guys. Look at this. Oh, it's so cute. It's so shiny. Hello, focus, hello. Yeah, this is super cute. Yeah. This is cute. <clears throat> uh, I got one more too. Mm. I don't love this one as much. Maybe I'll keep it on just so you can kind of see. <clears throat> I recently upgraded my phone, so that's why I got the new cases. But I mean, you can kind of see it's not like the best, but it's still really cute. And I think my phone is blue, by the way. I got the blue phone, and so it might not even really matter, honestly, because the blue is just going to shine through. But yeah, I'll probably just try on the stuff. Maybe who knows when. I'm not even gonna. Yeah. Probably have a whole different hairstyle on. Let's be real. But yeah, I'll catch up with you guys later. <laughs>